Hey, it's Whitney. I know it's been a long time since I've done a video. Thank you so much for your patience. Because of the holidays and now it's the new year, I feel like time has gone by so fast and I hope that you're not too disappointed in me for taking so long to do videos. Sometimes I just need to take a break and um, I'm working on being better about communicating that. I also hope that you've been keeping in touch with me through social media because I post a ton on Facebook, Snapchat, and Instagram stories is my favorite place to post. If you're not following me over there, on Instagram and clicking on the story, which is that 24 hour period of those kind of like live style, super authentic Snapchat style videos, I often post my favorite foods that I've been trying. So when I go out to restaurants, when I try new products, when I go grocery shopping, when I'm hanging out with friends. And on Snapchat, I tend to post just like random things happening in my life. So if you're ever missing videos and it's been a while since I've done one, go check me out over there. But let's dive into today's topic for this video because this is the beginning of a new little series that I'm gonna do called Things I've Been Meaning to Tell You. And this is especially appropriate because uh, there's a lot that I've been meaning to tell you in these past three months, but also for like a good chunk of 2016, things I didn't talk about. And then some of the things I'm gonna talk about in this series are things that I should have told you about years ago. And this isn't gonna be personal stuff. If you ever wanna know more about my personal life, I have a whole separate YouTube channel called Eco Vegan Gal Uncensored. It's linked down below if you've never heard of it before. That's where I talk about my personal stuff. And I'm quite open over there, by the way. But this series is gonna be mainly about products and some services that I've tried out that I've loved and I just haven't made a video about yet. So I have so far like 25 products and services I'm gonna do over the course of this series. And that's probably gonna expand <laughs> because there's a lot of things that I've forgotten about and because, uh, you know, I get new products and try new things all the time. I wanna begin with something that has been years in the making. I got this product, I think, in 2012. And I don't think I've ever like really openly talked about it. I may have mentioned it here and there. And that is my glasses. How many of you knew that I wear glasses? I love these glasses. So when I do wear them, I do feel very proud. I love this style. Um, I got these again in 2012 from this company called Eco Optics, which is now shifted a little bit. It's now under the Moto umbrella. And just like everything I'm gonna talk about today, it's linked to down below. There's all different styles that you can choose from. Their whole mission is to make sustainable, socially responsible glasses that are made of recycled materials. So it was right up my alley when I was looking to get a new pair of glasses years ago. And these have just stood the test of time. They're super durable. Um, I've had the lenses replaced a number of times and they've never broken. Uh, I've dropped these a lot. I also want to mention what's inside the frames. And this is actually very important because the company that made these lenses in my glasses is sponsoring this video. This company is called Lensable. I tried them out a few weeks ago and had such a phenomenal experience and it was a really wonderful tie-in to these glasses for a number of reasons. So number one, lenses can be really expensive. I think in the four years since I've had these frames, I had only switched out my lenses twice and I'm not very good or haven't been in the past very good at keeping my lenses from getting scratched. So for like the past year at least, my lenses had been super scratched, which made wearing glasses very uncomfortable and unpleasant. But I was so nervous about the price investment and I just like going to the eye doctor felt like such a chore. When I heard about Lensable, I was super excited. So the way it works is you go on their website, you enter in your prescription, you tell them what type of lenses you want, coating, you know, like a scratch resistant coating and you know, the type of special kind that changes in the sun and all of that. You go and enter all that information and they send you a box. You put your glasses in the box and send it off to them and then they 
switch out the lenses and send it back to you. When you get your lenses back, they send it to you in this box with like this little lens care kit. And you get those typically when you go to the eye doctor, but theirs just stood out, their little carrying case. And I, I just love the shape of this. <laughs> It's so unique. It looks really cool. So I carry this around with me in my purse, in my gym bag, I'll keep it on my desk. I just try to remind myself to take very good care of my lenses so I don't have to switch them out too much. It is at least half the cost of what I've spent in the past to get new lenses in my glasses. So it was a no brainer for me. The customer service was phenomenal. If you get some cool eco-friendly frames like this, you're gonna need new lenses anyway. So it all ties in together. Next up, I have something that I tried, I wanna say like six months ago. And this is a twig brush, different from just your standard toothbrush because it's literally just a twig. And uh, I'm not gonna take it out of the plastic because I'm not ready to use it yet, but that's it's sealed in this plastic for freshness because the twig's like kind of damp. You open this up and you kind of chew on it until it turns into these little bristles like you see on the side of this box. So your, your twig will look like that. And then you just rub it on your teeth. So similar to a toothbrush, uh, but you don't have to use any toothpaste. These remove plaque, they freshen your breath, they fight bacteria, whiten your teeth. It has a really interesting smell, so you definitely need to rinse this in the water. At first I was like, whoa, this is weird. But I really, really enjoyed this because it's just so simple. Aside from the plastic, um, I suppose it's a little less wasteful than a toothbrush. A lot of toothbrushes are made from plastic, um, so they end up in the oceans and never biodegrade. And then the bristles are often made from nylon. Nylon. Now, if you didn't know already, I'm a huge fan of the company Brush With Bamboo. Talked about them a ton, especially on social media. So they're my favorite toothbrush, but this is just worth an honorable mention. And especially because you don't have to use the toothpaste with it, that saves pla plastic and packaging as well. And it's less expensive. So I will link to them down below if you wanna check them out. Very sweet, small company. Next up is some body lotion. I know a lot of you are always curious about what body care products I'm using, and that's kind of the theme of this specific video, this series. I have been really loving this one called Earth Mama Angel Baby. This is their Angel Baby Lotion. So I suppose you could use this for babies, but that's probably what it's meant for, but it is so wonderful and I'm obviously not a baby. <laughs> it's got a great smell. This is their vanilla orange smell. It's not 100% organic, but they do use mostly organic ingredients in here. It just kind of goes on, makes my skin feel super smooth and soft and I've just been really enjoying it. So I wanted to give them a quick shout out. The last group of products that I wanna share with you come from a special box that I was sent from the detox market. And if you've been following my videos for a little while, you've probably heard me mention them before. The detox market is one of my favorite stores of all time. They have a physical store in Los Angeles and Toronto, I think. At one point they were in San Francisco and New York and they also have a phenomenal online shop. In fact, I think you can get even more products online than you can in their stores. They have the highest standards for natural beauty, body care, home goods, even some food. It's everything that they carry is unbelievable. Now I do want to give a little disclaimer that they are on the pricey side. That's usually how people react when they see their prices, but trust me, Everything they sell is worth it. I've never had anything from them that I was like, this was a waste of money. <laughs> like, It's so good, it lasts a long time and I can't wait to show you what I got. Now, I'm gonna link to some videos that I did on Facebook because I did live unboxings. You should definitely check out the Eco Vegan Gal Facebook page because I do live videos there from time to time, I'm trying to do them more regularly. And often I do unboxing videos because those are always kind of fun and, and like you get to experience live what my reactions are. And one of those was for the detox box. They had two that they've done recently. One was called The Best of Green Beauty and one was a partnership with a restaurant in California called Cafe Gratitude. So these are some of my favorite products from those two boxes. Starting with this, 
which I'm kind of obsessed with. This is a body serum. Now I'm gonna tell you about a facial serum in a moment, which is a, a type of product that I've loved for a very long time. Facial serums are like food for your skin. You absorb all these really great ingredients and they're good for keeping you moisturized, for anti-aging, for all sorts of different skin challenges. But I had no idea there was such thing as body serums and I can't get enough of this. This is the One Love Organics Gardenia Tea Antioxidant Body Serum. This smells absolutely divine and makes my skin feel phenomenal, but the smell is just like, whoa. It's You don't even need to put perfume on. It's so, so great. And a little bit goes a long way. It's kind of cool that it comes in this spray bottle. I love the smell, Gardenia. And you just rub it in all over your body, just like you would with the moisturizer. You feel great and you smell great. So since we're talking about serums, another one of the products I absolutely love is Audacity's Face Serum. And this tiny little bottle, a little bit goes a long way. This is the second one that I've tried. I forget what the other scent was. I wanna say it was like rose or something like that, maybe lavender or jasmine, maybe it was jasmine. Uh, these also smell unbelievable. And you take this tiny little dropper and rub this, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna pretend to rub it on my face because I have makeup on right now. I guess, actually you can put serums over your face, but I don't wanna like smudge anything. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It, this is a green tea and lemongrass, so super refreshing. It kind of smells like a green tea that you would drink. And uh, this can be used morning and night. Also from Audacite is this incredible face mask. I'm not a huge user of face masks, but when I tried this, I have been converted. It feels incredible and it's already working wonders. It comes in this really cool reusable jar, which may be made from glass, definitely not plastic. And it's this powder that you mix in with water or a variety of other things. It comes with like this little recipe book and it tells you all these different ways that you can kind of boost up the effectiveness of the ingredients. You can make like these little recipes for your skin. So you can mix it with water and lemon juice. You can mix it with milk, which could be vegan milk or, well, let's just say vegan milk, plant-based milk, <laughs> uh, vegan yogurt, orange juice. I mean, there's all these different things that you can do. But even just with water, which is how I've used it so far, it works wonders. You mix it in with the water, a tiny little bit teaspoon, which is, means this is gonna last me forever. And you put it on your face and you sit with it for like 15 minutes, it dries up, and you wash it off and your skin instantly feels softer. And one last product to tell you about is toothpaste, which is, Kind of interesting considering I was telling you about something that you could use without toothpaste earlier, but I know most of you are a little bit more traditional and you like to use, you know, the toothbrush, brush with bamboo, awesome company. Just saying, this David's toothpaste that came from the detox market has been so wonderful. I know some people get nervous when they're trying new natural products, especially when it comes to smell. Nobody wants to have bad breath and you're afraid to transition over to something natural because you feel like it won't be as effective. This is great. What's also cool about it is it's kind of like a metal uh, tube. The tube is recyclable. It's fluoride free. Um, it's American made. But best of all, it's really good for freshening your breath and whitening your teeth, getting rid of plaque. And uh, it tastes really good. It's like a nice mint flavor. So this is one of the better toothpastes I've ever tried. I've tried a lot of natural toothpaste out there and I'm loving this. Plus it lasts so long because you only need a tiny bit and there's so much in here. So that's the thing, like I was saying earlier, some of these products might be or seem like at first a big financial investment, but they're durable, they last a long time and they have great health benefits for you. You're doing a good thing for yourself and for the environment and for animals. So little investment goes a long way for making big long-term benefits. So that is it for today, at least this part of the Things I've Been Meaning to Tell You series. I have several other videos to do. I'm gonna do one all about food. I have another about makeup and various things I've been buying on one of my favorite websites. Um, I have one that's just gonna be about books, for those of you who love to read, and 
Oh, and one just all about different health things that you can do, which is probably the one I'm gonna do next. So stay tuned here on the Eco Vegan Gal YouTube channel. Thank you so much for all of your patience for those of you who have been missing my videos. Again, I'm on social media pretty much every day on Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter. I feel like I'm missing something, but I'm active on there. You can reach me, you can private message me. In fact, I love, love, love getting private messages from people on Instagram on my stories, like that's become one of my favorite ways to communicate with you. So if you see something on there and you wanna say something, ask a question, I respond pretty much immediately. So it's a really great way to stay in touch with me. I would love to hear from you in the comments what you think about these products, if you have any questions about them or requests. If you're brand new to this channel and you like this video, you wanna see the other videos coming up, be sure to subscribe. Check the links out down below in the description field. And that'll do it for today. I'll see you very soon. Bye and happy new year.